Ladies and gentlemen, tonight we have a very rare public appearance by one of Australia's funny men, Elliot Goblet. A fabulous introduction, Michael. I really appreciate it, and I think I'll always appreciate it for as long as I live. You can quote me on that. Yeah, good evening. I'm Elliot Goblet, and if you don't mind, I'll just press on without getting all of your names. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit sad right now because my new kitten ran away and obviously wanted to make it a complete break because the kitty litter's gone too. <laughs> I've always wanted a four-wheel drive, so I've just had another three steering wheels added to my car. <laughs> I'm happy to announce that I've finally set a date for my wedding, October 21st this year. It's not very far away, so I'm hoping to meet a girl real soon. <laughs> this is a large audience. Last month I was in front of a very small audience of just one person. Surprise party for Arthur Tunstall. <laughs> Whenever I pull into a service station, I always ask for a fresh petrol nozzle. Just can't be too careful these days. <laughs> I don't know about you people, but I'm sick and tired of seeing streakers at sporting events. I believe the true punishment for streakers at the cricket is to make them stay on the ground and bat. <laughs> Just for over or 200. One time I went for a job interview, but it only lasted two minutes because on that day I just wasn't in the mood to answer any questions. <laughs> Lately I've been hiring myself out to go away with honeymoon couples where I just sit at the bedside and help them get through the awkward moments. <laughs> I don't come cheap, but I am effective. <laughs> I got tired of seeing a sink full of dirty dishes, so I had the bottom of my sink lowered. When I paint my house and use two coats of paint to save time, I just mix the two coats together and paint once. <laughs> I've got a holiday flat down the street from where I live that's so that when I'm away I can keep an eye on my house for burglars. <laughs> Thank you. Last week I had mumps, measles, malaria, hay fever, yellow fever, glandular fever, hepatitis, arthritis, dermatitis, sinusitis, tonsillitis, laryngitis, gallstones, kidney stones, diabetes, piles and tinea. But I'm okay now. <laughs> my doctor told me not to eat any red meat so I dye my steaks green. You know, when I'm in a queue, I'm really paranoid that somebody's going to push in, so I'll stand hard up against the person in front of me. <laughs> and it doesn't take long before people just let me pass through to the front counter. <laughs> I like to go to an information booth and ask how to get to the nearest other information booth. <laughs> and when they tell me, I say, but I've just come from there. I like to post letters to myself and when I get them I write, not known at this address. <laughs> I like to stand at a urinal with a clipboard and after each guy finishes off, mark a cross or a tick. <laughs> that really keeps them guessing. <laughs> I worry about the effect of spray cans on the ozone layer, so I use a roll-on fly spray. <laughs> but you've got to be quick to catch the little buggers. <laughs> I don't know about you people, but I really hate it when somebody comes to your front door and puts their finger over the peephole. So to get around that, I've got 11 peepholes. <laughs> My time's up, but I really appreciate you people supporting this great cause. Thanks very much. Bye.